Uh, this is a new position with Farming Smarter. It's part of a pilot project. Um, we received some funding from a non-government organization called Farmers for Climate Solutions. And what this group really was interested in doing was they've created these really in-depth modules on subjects that they've um, found funding for and interest for in nitrogen management, cover cropping, and grazing. And they created these really great in-depth local modules for the public to, to access. And then what they also wanted to do was give some funding to local agriculture groups for to fund support um, for yeah someone to help farms who are interested in implementing or changing any practices that fall under these three umbrellas so my role as a conservation agronomist will be to offer my support and the support of farming smarter and the knowledge that we've gained through many research projects that we've done for the past 10, 12 years um, to help farms um, with the practices that they're doing now and anything that they really want to change or they want to try something new. Um, that would be my role as support. So I would learn from them, um, learn specifically what, what their challenges are and how they would like to improve their on-farm best management practices. So it's really a unique um, funding and research opportunity because it's not it doesn't have any specific parameters it's how are you working as a farming business and what would you like to change or what would you like to improve or where would you like support um, it so it's it's so individual and personally focused that it, I think it's really exciting and really cool and I, I hope that it's coming across as like a really valuable resource because it's funded support and and the, uh, anyone who chooses to participate would get uh, you know some really great access to some really good knowledge and like a network of people who would be interested in helping with these kind of things. Uh, Alberta government had an agriculture extension program where they provided regional agronomists in each area to offer independent support for the producers and the farms of the area. Um, and over you know, the past 20, 30 years, those extension programs have been gone. So this program with Farming Smarter, it's referenced as providing some of that independent support that those regional agronomists used to provide that no longer exists. Yeah, so I'm really hoping that we can take away individual regional knowledge for Farming Smarter and for our growers here. Um, there's so many resources out there in this world of studies and um, you know, practices that are done throughout the world. Let's say cover crops, for example. Cover crops are so regionally specific that you can look and access knowledge from other areas, but if you don't know how it's gonna respond, in your specific region, it can be really challenging to adopt and it might be very successful somewhere else, but not successful here. So I'm hoping that I can take away some of that individual knowledge and help be, you know, of value to those who are interested in learning about those things very specific to our area. All they have to do is go on the Farming Smarter website and uh, go to the Meet the Team group. My name is there, Ashley Wagner. My email is there. My phone number is there. Um, yeah, they just need to shoot me an email or call the Farming Smarter office or stop by. I'm accessible anytime. And um, yeah, then we can just have a chat about individual needs and wants and hopefully uh, uh, people can be excited about having some support to help you know, help with the little things that they want to maybe adjust or change or something new on their farm. Um, the one last thing I want to add is along with my support, I also am going to have a mentor, Robert Dunn. Um, and I, I referenced those agriculture extension agronomists that they used to have. He was one of those way back in the day. So he has a wealth of 30 years of knowledge of Southern Alberta um, conservation practices and novel crops that were tried and practices that he's seen come and go. So he will be working with me as my support. So 
the wealth of knowledge that we have that we can access and hopefully adapt to what farms are looking for, I think is awesome. Mm -hmm.